Laura Bernhard, an arborist community expert, here talking about how to untie what you might think is a knife knot. I originally composed this video for my grandchildren, but I felt it was valuable enough to share here. So yesterday we had to pull a tree down using the tractor and we had the, the ropes here tied together and when the tractor pulled so hard, this knot got so tight, like it's, you can't even move it with your hand to untie it. So a lot of people call this a knife knot, meaning the only way you can untie it is to cut the rope and then you have a shorter rope and you lose, lose quite a bit of uh, good rope in the process. But I came up with a, a way to loosen them up and I, I just untied the, the, the other end. The other end was tied and I thought for sure even my me new method wouldn't work, but I'm gonna try it for this one too. I ha we had to tie three ropes together to um, get the right angle to pull the tree. So you know what the method is? Let me show you. I'll see if I can switch this around. I can't, but anyway, let's see if it, where it works. You use a rubber mallet and you whack it. And you whack it and you whack it. A lot of times, and after a while, it starts to loosen up. You'd be surprised. That other one is even tighter than this, so I have high hopes that this one will loosen up too. And since I can't see where I'm aiming the camera, I'm gonna stop it for a minute. I'm gonna whack it some more and see how it goes. All right, bye-bye. Okay, so I, I whacked it a lot, a lot of times, and uh, look at this. It's it's loosening up. We got some some slack in between the coils, even though I still can't untie it with my hands. If I it can wiggle now, see that it's starting to get loose, and you can see space between the coils. Like I can even move the coils a little bit with my hands. So I'm um, I'm confident that I can get this to come undone if I just keep whacking at it and working it now and then. It's only took a few minutes already and look how far we've come. Look at that. And there's the cowboy. Wants a stick. Get. Good boy. So here we've made some progress. Look at this. Look at how much, look at how wiggly it is now. I just whacked it a few more minutes and look at that. It's really loosening up. I still can't get it undone with my hands, but I can I can work it a little bit. And if I whack it a few more minutes, I think I'll get this undone, which is really good because it was probably like two and a half feet for the red rope, two and a half feet for the white rope, and that was two knots, so that's two and a half and two and a half is five. 5 plus 5 is 10. That would have been 10 feet of rope I would have lost just from one tree being taken down where the the pressure on the knot was so great that the knot just bound up. But it wasn't a knife knot after all because I learned the trick of how to loosen knots up. Look at that. I'm, I'm getting it with my hand. Um, I'm wondering if anyone else knows this trick because that was a lot of pressure with the tractor pulling it to, uh, to the, the knot just got so, so tight. And I think most people just end up cutting their, their rope and losing all that rope. So I should put out the word and play with the doggy.